that's in the car. <laughs> the Panda Motor Works ultimate maintenance kit for your Focus ST. We're finally gonna get around to doing it now that there's snow on the ground and whatnot. I've got Lane here to not so much help, but he's here. Look what I can do! What the hell was that? Probably gonna go ahead and start out with the spark plugs. I kind of want to do a compression test while it's warm. And we just drove up here 30 miles. <laughs> anyway, so uh, yeah, going to uh, go ahead and get the uh, hood popped on this here girl and get the plugs pulled out and do a compression test. Moving on. helping cleaning the air filter such a nice well guy all right so they're there Got them all out. Mm, considering we were just cruising on the way up here, they don't really look too bad. There's no wide open throttle poles or anything. A little bit of discoloration. I don't know. Just gonna do the right thing and do a compression test and then ignore results of that and those and then just put it back together. Zane's gonna do the honors of holding the camera and watching the gauge. And uh, we're gonna find out what kind of compression this thing is. Ooh. Hoping for good results. See. So the first one was around 145 or so. 145 is good. Uh oh. I got it. Boop. Same. Same? Yes. Same, same? Same, same. Ah. Two for two. Two, two. Trace. I don't have 125. That's it? Yeah. I'll do it again. About 130. 125, 130. Kind of discouraging. One more. What to do with the number that's three? That one uh, topped out at 125. Well, that's kind of discouraging. So we got 140 on both the front ones, 130, and a 125. 130, 125, yeah. All right, well, I'm going to do the correct thing and ignore that and put new plugs in and move on to the oil change and the transmission. Fix it, make it better. <laughs> A few moments later. Alright, got the plugs back in, coils back in, Lane's putting the air filter back on. Now we're going to go ahead and get this thing up in the air and get the motor oil and the transmission oil drained. Moto, 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 moto. The transmission drain plug, ignore my ghetto rigged uh, underglow, still need to do something with all that. Anyway, uh, right here is your drain plug for your transmission, and right there is the fill plug. Obviously the fill plug is going to be kind of fun, uh, and when I have this tire off, it will make it really easy to stick a bottle up here and into the hole. This is how we do it. Got it. About to change the blinker fluid. 130,000 miles have probably never been changed. Oh, 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 
it's, it's so bad. <laughs> Splashing me! Now to gain access to the fill plug. Grippy boy, that was horrible. Darkness, come here, darkness. I don't give a fuck what none of y'all people think. Just like that. So I was gonna struggle bus trying to find a way to put this in as if I was in my driveway, but the fun fact is, is I'm not in my driveway, so. I'm gonna use this here Mighty Vac transmission fluid putter inner device. Mm. Oh my God, it's like clear. What we gonna do here? Take this here little doohickey, shove it in that hole, and then we're just gonna put pump it, pump it this up. Pump, pump it up, and it's gonna. When I open that, and put some pressure in here, and it's just gonna whoop and fill it on up. A little longer than a few minutes later. All right, transmission is full. A brand new, not really dark fluid. This is the farthest I've gone since I got the car, and it's one of changes too, so it's probably gonna be blacker than Toby's butt tops. <laughs> huh. Stop. Got our genuine motorcraft filter. Piece of lint on it. Don't want that in my motor. Anyway, um, for filters, what I do, any filter that screws up like this, I fill it with oil. If they go in like this, or this certain dumb GM and foreign crap where they go like that, you obviously can't put fluid in it. But we can, so. Oh, look at this fancy thing. I'm sorry I'm like this. Yeah. Oh, look at how much bigger that filter is compared to this. See, this is why you should not run off-brand filters. Aftermarket poo-poo. Motocraft filter is literally twice the size of the Parts Master junk that was on there. Mm. Give her a little <coughs> break clean, clean it all up real good, put the drain plug back in, and then we'll uh, set it down. And... It has a nipple on it. So there you have it. Maintenance kit installed. Found out that we've got a bit of a variation in compression, which sucks, but like I said, I'm gonna do the right thing and ignore that. Um, yeah, so uh, I think we are. Uh, as ready as we can be for winter. So, thanks for watching, y'all. Until next time, guys. Peace.